congratulations. Can barely see you through all the shiny <laughs> silverware. Um, three times, I think, Serena said, now it's time to party. So how wild is it going to get? It's already been pretty wild, I think. <laughs> but no, we're, we're ready to party and celebrate these moments. What was it like the moment you realised that you were going to be a history maker and a European champion? Yeah, I think there was um, a few tears for sure. Um, I think a lot of the girls ran over to Jill. I think Jill and Ellen, you know, they've been in the squad for such a long time and it was a really nice moment for them. But, yeah, I don't know. I don't think it's still sunk I, in. Yeah, really. I think we're in shock at the moment. Yeah. I don't think it's sunk in. It's, yeah. yeah, it's been mental. Who did you look for in the crowd? I assume you've got lots of friends and family there. Did you, did you find them? Did you get to have a moment? Yeah. I always look for your mum, actually. Yeah, everyone looks for my mum. She's always the one dancing with a flag normally. But, um... <laughs> Yeah, uh, I found my mum and dad and brother straight away and got quite emotional with them. And yeah, these are the moments. They worked so hard to get us where we are today and to celebrate them. this moment today with them is incredible. And Beth, you're now a history maker, a trailblazer, an icon. Are you ready for everything that's coming your way? <laughs> no, nah, I'm just Beth me. That's me. I'm, you better I'm, be sharing it with everyone else. Of course I will. I'm joking. <laughs> I think no, there's probably going to be enough to go around here, right? <laughs> It doesn't sound right, though. Like, for me, I'm still best made. I play football, something that I love doing. Like, for me, it's just a dream come true, what I'm doing. What about for you, Kira? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'm, yeah, same as Beth. Like, I'm from Rochdale, you know what I mean? Like, it's, yeah, it's just crazy to think that I've just played in the European final. We've just won the European final, and, yeah, it's just absolutely incredible, and I'm doing it with people that I've grown up with, I, I've played with for eight, nine years, you know? Yeah, it's just an unbelievable feeling, and I don't think, yeah, it's, it's sank in yet, and I think the partying's going to last for a few days, to be fair. You've just had a message from the Queen. I love where I'm We, we it. don't know this. We've not even looked at our phones yeah. to begin with. I mean, yeah, honestly, I don't... Yeah, we're just enjoying the moment. Uh, and a word just finally um, from you both on Serena, particularly this week, particularly when you went to extra time. What did she say to you? What difference did she make when it really mattered? What a woman. What a woman. <laughs> Do you know what? She was so calm. She believed in us. We believed in each other as a team. And, you know, she didn't actually have to say that much. We believed in the ability of this squad. And here we are. And for you, Kira, the influence she's had on you over these past few months? Yeah, I just think for the confidence of the squad and, and each individual, I think she makes us feel so valued. And you can see that in the way that we're playing, you know. Everyone's, everyone brings something to the pitch, you know, even the girls that have come on at the end, they've, they've been unbelievable and, yeah, she's just, she's just an amazing person and the rest of the backroom staff are as well, you know, it's not just Serena, her assistants, the physios, everyone, it, it's been a real team effort and I'm just glad that we can all share the trophy tonight. Thanks, Gail. Uh, just wary that um, they want to get back and see their family and friends. If we can keep to one question for each, that would be great. <laughs> um, yeah, just Kira, just a, a word on, on Chloe Kelly, obviously a teammate of yours. That, that given, you know, the year she's had coming back from ACL and then to come on and score the winning goal in a Euros final, like, how incredible is that? You must be so proud and happy for her. Yeah, I mean, it's almost like it was... Um, just... <laughs> oh, no, I've got a spillage. <laughs> yeah, I think it, it's almost like it was written in the stars for her. I think we've all seen, especially at the club, the, the hard work she's put in over the last nine, ten months and... Yeah, it, it, she deserves this moment, and I'm not sure about taking a top off, to be fair. But, um, yeah, to be, yeah she, she's just an unbelievable person as well. I don't think it's just as a footballer. She's such a, a great girl to have in around the squad, and, yeah, she was in the right place at the right moment, and, yeah, she scored the winning goal for us. So, yeah, she's, she's a hero, to be fair. 